Hey cuties, what's up and welcome back to my Roblox channel. Now before we get going, make sure to like this video, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications. You guys, don't forget because I just dropped my brand new song, Girls World, and you can stream it on all streaming platforms. Also, my Girls World merch is live on HeyCuties.com right now. You can get the cutest pink tie-dye hoodie with me and Sky on it, my Girls World poster, and my pink back-to-school backpack. Plus, for every item that you purchase within the next 11 days, you will get one entry into my giveaway for a chance of winning AirPods or an iPad. So the more you buy, the more chances you have at winning. Anyway, so in today's role-playing video, I'm going to be taking you guys through the life of a cheerleader. Come on, Marina! I want to see a roundup double backflip. But Coach Igor, I'm so tired. Only losers get tired, Marina. This is why you have never won the gold medal at the Olympics. You are second best. You are silver. I'm sorry, Coach Igor. Sorry is for wimps. I I don't think I can go on any further. Oh, you are getting so lazy and so fat. I'm not Pregnant? This is the first I'm hearing of it. I told you like a million times. Well, there is no time to be pregnant. There is only time for gymnastics. Now do a backflip. I can't. I said do a backflip. Okay, fine. <laughs> what is that infernal noise? I think I just gave birth to a little baby girl. Ew, get rid of that thing. We need to focus on getting you back into the Olympics. Also, start losing weight right now! You know what? You are the worst. I quit! Wait? Nobody quits on Coach Igor's team. Oh, yeah? Well, I just did a sayonara, Coach Igor! She'll be back. They always come back. A few moments later. Hi! Welcome to Brooks Burgers! How can I help you? Uh, I'll have a double cheeseburger with extra raw onions and a side of raw garlic. Ew! Gross! Bob! Marina, what are you doing here? I thought you were training for the Olympics. I haven't seen you in nine months. Well, about that, you see, I've just had a baby and, well, it's yours. Say what? I'm sorry I didn't tell you sooner, but I was so busy with gymnastics. I hope you don't hate me. Of course I don't hate you. I love you, and I love our beautiful baby girl. What should we name her? Mackenzie, after my mother. That is a beautiful name. Let's give our little girl the best life possible. Marina, will you marry me? Oh, Bob, yes, yes, a thousand times yes. Oh, uh, can I get my burger now? Mackenzie, are you dressed yet? Almost, Mom. I swear, it takes five-year-olds longer to get dressed than a grown woman. Well, she's dead mother's daughter. Hey, mom, I'm ready. Where did you get that? In your box of old stuff. Take that off this instant. But oh, why? I want to be a cheerleader just like you were. Take it off. Ugh! She did look super cute. I do not want our daughter to be a cheerleader. It was too hard. I understand, but she needs to be ready soon. We're going to miss the start of the game. Two hours later. Ladies and Gentlemen, welcome back to the first game of the Brookhaven High Basketball Season. We've got the Brookhaven Bandits facing off against the Bloxburg Buccaneers. Now, let me hear you scream. <laughs> Woohoo! Don't cheer, honey. This promises to be the battle of a century. Let's hope the Brookhaven Bandits take home the win. One hour later. Well, it's halftime, folks, and Brookhaven is losing bad. They are down 20 points, and their morale has completely been decimated. Ugh, why are the bandits playing better? Well, they just lack fundamentals, honey. No, I don't think that's right. I think it's the crowd. They need to get hyped up. I'll be right back. Mackenzie, don't. B-I-C-K-O-R-Y. That's a bandit battle cry. Victory, victory, victory. Give me an F. F. Give me an I. I. Give me a D-H-T. D-H-T. What's that spell? Break. Looks like the cheer has given the bandits the spark they need. Uh-oh. Looks like our daughter is a cheerleader. Practicing if we want 
to do well at regionals. Ah, oh, cheerleading is so flipping hard. Especially when you're trying to do flips hard. Very funny, Sky. I wasn't making a joke. Flips are hard. They aren't that tough. I mean, look at this. Ah! Well, that's easy for you because you're like a cheerleading prodigy. Well, maybe I am. But with me leading us, I know we will nail regionals tomorrow. The next day. Coming to the stage next is the Brookhaven Bandit Cheerleading Squad led by Mackenzie. Woohoo! You may be good at football, you may be good at track, but when it comes to basketball, you better watch your back. Go Bandit! All right, girls, time to tumble. Ah! <laughs> Yikes, looks like the Brookhaven bandits have all simultaneously injured themselves. We'll be right back. A few moments later. Yeah, sorry we totally destroyed your chances at winning the cheerleading competition, Mackenzie. That's okay, Sky. Cheerleading's all about having fun and not always winning the competition. That is where I disagree. Uh, who are you? I am Coach Igor, head coach of the Roblox gymnastics team. Gymnastics? It's basically like cheerleading, but way more intense. And you get gold medals if you're the best. Oh, cool. I saw you out there. You have a real talent. I haven't seen anyone like that, well, since your mother. You know my mom? I used to train her, but she did not have the will of a champion. Do you have the will of a champion? I sure do. Great, then meet me at my gym tomorrow. Three hours later. Mom! another gold medal in 2024. Thanks, coach. Now, I want to see a hundred more sit-ups. Oh, I'm sorry, coach Igor, but I can't today. I've got a date. A what now? I've got a date with my new boyfriend, Josh. Oh, I forbid it. No gymnast of mine is going to be having a boyfriend. You are married to the sport. But that's not fair. Oh, hey, Mackenzie. Hey, Josh. Is this the dog you're dating? He is so small and puny. I will crush him with my fist. Whoa, dude, relax. I will not relax. I will kill you. Hey, stop it. Ah, you just hit me. Now you owe me 200 sit-ups. No, we're leaving. She'll be back. They always come back. Two hours later. Ugh, I hate Igor so much. Yeah, that dude is kind of a bully. I know. Oh, gosh. My mom was totally right about him. What do you mean? My mom warned me that Coach Igor was a cruel man. And she was right. We had a big fight about it. And we hadn't spoke since. Whoa, heavy. But I know what to do now. I have to make this right. The next day. Now run! Run! I can't run anymore. I said run, you little Megan. Coach Igor. Ah, Mackenzie, I knew that you would come back to me. I trust that you have broken up with that idiot boy. No, I haven't. I just came to say goodbye. Goodbye? So you're quitting gymnastics? No, I've just found a new coach. A nicer coach. Who? Tell me from Bloxburg that guy's a real meatball. Nope, it's me. Marina? I thought I would never see you again. Well, you're seeing me now. I'm taking my daughter back and I'm taking all of these girls with me. Ha! Good luck. Hi, little girls. Yes? How is you like a coach who doesn't yell at you? I like that very much. Me too. <laughs> Goodbye, Coach Igor. Hey, Mom. I'm glad we're friends again. Me too. All right, girls. Let's try a backflip. <laughs> Okay, we all have to be bad at something before we get good at it. Was your daughter Bethany ever bad at gymnastics? Well, sure. When my 
my daughter first started doing gymnastics, she was not good at it. She didn't know the difference between a somersault and a back handspring. And now she's the most decorated Olympian of all time. Whoa, do you think I could be an Olympian? Of course you can, sweetheart. You can do anything that you set your mind to. Mackenzie, let's go! We're about to be late! Your daughter is giving her Hall of Fame speech in an hour! All right, cuties, that's enough gymnastics for one day. You guys go home and get some rest. Thanks! Right, now let's go to this Hall of Fame ceremony. Two hours later. And now, without further ado, I would like to welcome to the stage 10-time gold medal Olympian and daughter of iconic gymnastic coach Mackenzie Turner, our Hall of Fame recipient, Bethany Turner! One week later. All right, basketball fans, you know that sound. It's halftime. And for this week's game, we got a performance by the world's oldest cheerleader. Put your hands together for Mackenzie Turner. Give me an F. F. Give me an I. I. Give me a GHT. GHT. What's that spell? Wait. She is so awesome! Me, hey, do a backflip! Oh, I don't know! I might be too old! Backflip! 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 All right, well, here goes nothing! Ah! <gasps> uh, I think she's dead. Whoa, looks like the world's oldest cheerleader is now the world's deadest cheerleader. We'll be right back after these commercials. <laughs> So thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to comment down below which Brookhaven role-playing video you guys want to see me do next. And congratulations to Fun with Lily for being our post notification winner. If you guys want to be our next post notification winner, all you have to do is turn those post notifications on and comment done when you're done. And always make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and turn those post notifications on so you can alert every time I upload a new video. And remember guys, always be a unicorn. Bye! The Girls World Collection is officially live on HeyCuties.com! We've got this adorable tie-dye hoodie with me and Sky on it, our super cute Girls World posters, our back-to-school backpack, and of course, our Mackenzie plushie. So click the link in my description to visit HeyCuties.com. Oh, and don't forget to stream Girls World. <laughs>